Hey guys, this is Connor, Tracy Freeman's son. I am a really good fisherman, and I'm not meaning to brag, but I'm here to give you some fishing tips. Some of the tips that I use when I'm fishing is when you're salmon fishing, you don't want to get your hands, like the scent on your hands always gets onto the bait. So I used to like latex gloves that fit tightly. If you use the sag ones, they can actually release oils into the bait. Let's check out a few clips down in the description below. So, here's some tips. When you're cutting the bait, you wanna cut it diagonally, facing this way, so you cut down straight. So it makes a little bit of a shiny spin. Also, make sure you brine your bait. If you don't brine it, you could just get like scales that fall off. Brine bait creates shine, scales, and betterness. You can also find more videos about this fishing tip in the description below. Let's get started. I want you guys to ask questions. So uh, here's one question that I just got on my phone. Okay. What do you like to use when you go salmon fishing? Um, I use herring. I like to use a flasher and then a three feet, about two feet or three feet line below that, then a flasher, the hook goes through the top and to the bottom, and it gives it a nice spin. Okay, next question. Um, what is your favorite type of label of herring? I say for springers, you go green label. For fallen chinook, um, I say red or blue label herring. Uh, next question. Um, where do you like to fish for salmon? Okay, I like to fish. Here's a place that is really awesome. I like to fish Columbia River, Astoria, Buoy 10, Willamette. You can even fish in the Clackamas River. So uh, I think that's also a really good question. Next question. What is your favorite kind of salmon to eat? Um, let's see. My favorite kind of salmon to eat. I like coho. Now, everybody says Chinook is a king salmon. It's so good. And, uh, uh. Well, I can tell you what. There is a big difference between a Chinook and a coho. See, the sh coho is a silver salmon. So it's got a very, very small, um, you know, it's got the white lip and everything. But it's got a darker, more rich meat. Now, the Chinook has a more paler meat. It's flaky. It's not as, like, whole as a coho. So that's my guess. It could be better. What do you do before making your salmon into sushi? Well, I don't really make my salmon into sushi. I love sushi. I love salmon nigiri. But um, if you do, you need to freeze it first. And you don't use the side meat. You only use the belly meat. Um, okay, so those are our questions and tips that people had for me. Um, I'll see you later. Bye.